people welcome to my channel leafy junkie here uh, i'm doing a video for propagating one range as you can see i've got two different variety here the quicksilver which is currently living in a hanging pot in the spare room and my wandering Jew. Um, yeah, I'm gonna propagate it because on this one, it's a gap at the back. I wanted to basically put like cuttings in there to grow. So what I need to do this is I've got this um, a cutter, I don't know the special term for it, but yeah, I washed it properly, so it's sterilized. Um, I'm gonna be using a all-purpose compost soil with some cacti mix soil as well, and a bit of perlite as well to help the drainage here. Um, so basically, on each leaf, the node it's just up to it so you can for example here um, I could have there's a node there a node there probably not so clear because of the color another one there and another one there what I'll do is make sure it's long enough maybe like two leaves and after just gonna cut it kind of like 45 degrees just in between so I've got my first one what I'll do now is get rid of the, um, the bottom leaf because that's going to be sitting on, in the soil anyway so do the node somewhere here um, so, uh, okay. yeah the root will come out somewhere here it will grow um, I think I might try two different ways uh, for this. The, uh, so what I'll do is dig a hole. Of the, um, the bottom there. So I'm gonna stick that in. And just like push the soil. Make sure the node is under. It's um, buried in the soil because obviously the root will come out there the first one uh, okay I'm just rotating so I can see it better again I'll show you here there's um, one two nodes I'll do is cut one from here 45 degrees angle again I'm gonna get rid of the bottom leaf I, yeah because it will be just under the soil okay I don't know if you can see that better so the first one I'm cutting is there that one there and I'm gonna put another one here just put in there like then make sure the node is uh, you know it's covered by the soil they got tangled up I'm gonna cut more so I can start like a new part so I'm just trying to get rid of this um, dead leaf okay so I'm gonna cut another one where I'm cutting it from right right well let's add some soil first on the part where we're going to be putting it right. I've 
I've already got this mix here. Um, yeah, it's potting soil, cocktail soil, and some perlite. Let's do this one first. So it's about one centimeter. Leave like, you know, from the top of the pot. I mean, there's a line inside of the pot, so you can just follow that. Okay, I'm gonna, again, I'm gonna pull the leaf at the bottom. And with the help of stick, it's just avoiding, obviously, breaking the stem when you're pushing it to the soil. And then just make sure it's um, where you want it to face. Okay. And there's one. Right. Uh, let's see. I think I can probably get one from. Here as well. Again, I'm gonna take it off, pull it gently. And dig a hole, insert, and cover with the soil. Um, I'll show you the, the shot at the end where obviously I've completed the, the pot. Here's one pot that I've filled in with cuttings. Um, also, doing this, it will help the original plant to, um, to grow bushy. Um, it'll be a lot more healthy as well because it's going to be um, helping it to have some more shoot. Um, hopefully not so long um, that won't take that long to um, you know produce more leaves probably I don't know three to four weeks it should have more new shoots and um, they're really easy to grow uh, and easy to propagate but yeah I'm doing this method where I'm just I just stick it in the basically put it in the soil straight away and then I'll be doing cuttings as well where I'm gonna put it like I said I put it in a in water to root and basically perhaps I'll compare which one grow faster okay so I guess it's the same for this one just find the node the node would be the each uh, after each leaf it's got the lighter color and um, just make sure it's long enough so when you obviously put in the soil you know so i'm gonna be cutting 45 degrees <coughs> okay I'm pull the um the leaf so i just left it that size actually i could probably pull the other one Yep, so leave it that one. Then dig and put it, then dig it and cover with the soil. Okay, so that's one there. Let's find another one, and the long one. Okay, so this probably just here. Yep, I'll leave it as that. Actually, um, I'll put it back to the original pot. What I'll do is do the cuttings first and I'll show you what I'm about to do. Okay. Mm. 
Right, I got three so far. And then seven on the bump from here. Right, so this is the original. What I'll do is basically stick those cuttings at the back so it will have more compact and covers the whole pup. I'll just move that one away. Okay, so I'm gonna dig and insert the cutting. Okay, cover it and do for all of it. Do the same for all of it. Right. There you go. And last one. Probably just a bit more soil on top from this part. So, you know, it will help obviously to stay in there. Okay, that's that. So I'm going to spray it with some water on the bottom of the soil. Not so much. Okay, so that's for the quicksilver one. That will go back to its hanging pot. And then this one here as well. Spray a bit of water. So that's that. And the original, just move that to the side. In the original, I can see that it probably needs more soil. So I'm going to add some more. This one will be longer on each leaf, but I will update you and make another video at that time. Um, so yeah, this is Leafy Junkie. I'll see you in the next video. Take care. And just to show you the other method, I've only got one cutting. This one, I've got a colleague's cutting there and just a monstera, which um, fell from the uh, mother plant and just put it in this cylinder just to keep it sort of like fresh so you can see it's still green it's been there for like I think it must have been three weeks same for the um, this one the potos so I just sitting there for a few weeks now and staying green which is good <laughs> So I've got my colleagues, like I said, in there, rooting it, but I will add this with them. And hopefully a couple of weeks time we'll root as well. So yeah, that's another method.